like days Only been days, but it feel like months Just finished my toes. It's 109. My wax appointment was at 1. Luckily, it's not like with like a wax, like, not, I don't even know what to call it. But it's not with like somebody home based or like in a salon. It's like a waxing place, just period. Like it's like an establishment or whatever. So they don't even be tripping about lateness or not showing up or none of that. So I think I should be fine. Anyways, my toes came out so cute. Like I'm about to go back to that specific girl that I went to because last time I went, it was cute, but it really wasn't like what I 100% wanted. But he did a good job. Yeah, I love that nail place. I love that nail shop in general. Like they all do really good, but that girl, she ate down. She ate down. And then I had got um, acrylic on my big toe. I never really do that. I don't know why it's taking me this way to go to this place. Because I know where this is at. And I never go this way. This is weird. Anyways, I got it before on my big toe. And honestly, like, it's cute. But just, like, maintaining it. Like, especially, like, you wear shoes a lot or you work out like i remember when i got it a couple years ago it actually had freaking broke because i was running track at the time and i had acrylic toes and i was just like after that i would never get that get it again but i was like you know what my freaking toenail was broke on the side and i just was like no i'm not about to do it but they came out cute Look. not for the frito not for the frito not for the free ski. <laughs> I'm like four minutes away from the wax place. I haven't ate anything. I'm sitting in a nail shop like, bro, I haven't ate anything and I'm about to go get waxed. Like, are you trying to pass out? Are you trying to, like, girl? And it's like, I really need to stop doing this because I don't, like, tend to eat breakfast. Like, well, not. I'm not going to say I, ha I tend to do that. It's really just been, like, these past couple of, weeks that I will wake up and only drink kombucha because I'm trying to get my flat stomach for my trip okay I'm just a girl okay but yeah I haven't really been like eating breakfast and then I have class at like 11 so I'll just go to class and not eat breakfast and then my first meal will be at like one two um so I haven't ate so we'll see how this goes but Okay, so I just got my eyebrows done and honestly forgot I even booked the Brazilian brow combo, but don't mind my hair, but about to get my wax. So, we got to change. <sighs> it's hot in this car, Jesus Christ. I just finished getting my wax. I didn't record because what do I need to record for? <laughs> that junk hurt. I haven't got waxed in months, I'm not going to lie, because it's like, I don't be having the money, or I don't be wanting to spend that, like, I'd rather just shave if it's going to be free, but it hurt, y'all, like, I'm not going to lie, but she did a good job, um, and then I also got my eyebrows, wax, um, eyebrows threaded, that hurt too, but she did a really good job, I actually really like them, 
They look fine. They probably look a little crazy right now because my, my skin is sensitive like in this area. So I get my eyebrows done, it'd be like red and like just, it doesn't look cute. I'm about to go home. It's 2.08 so I have like an hour and some change to spare before I have to go to my um, nail appointment. But I need to eat something like right now. Like right now. I don't know what I'm about to eat though when I get home. I'm trying to think about what do I even have. Because I don't know. Okay, so you know how I had got my eyebrows done? Because I had forgot that I even booked it. So I had intended on getting my eyebrows done by another person. Like actually like a brow tech that was going to... Um, like laminate no she wasn't gonna laminate she was gonna wax them and tint them and I was gonna be 50 which I was gonna be like okay whatever but since I got my eyebrows done I'm like well it's no point of going you know but my point in saying that is hold on I'm trying to get gas real quick Never stand outside if you're pumping gas. Get in the car, lock the door, and you wait. <laughs> Let's see how much 20 gets in my tank. Cause my my car, one thing about it, it does really good on gas. Really good. I probably fill my tank up once a month, maybe twice, depending on how much I drive. But my car does really good on gas. All right, we're done. Moment of truth. Almost half a tank in some mo. Mind y'all, I kind of went to a not expensive gas station, but definitely a little expensive. It's three sixty nine here. And normally, I'd be going to ones that'd be like three fifteen, three twenty. So imagine if I would have went to one of those. Okay, so you know how I was talking about how I got my eyebrows done, and I didn't remember that I even had an appointment to get my eyebrows done there. So I actually booked an appointment with the eyebrow person that does like lamination, tint, wax, stuff like that. And she does really good, like really good. My cousin went to her um, like two days ago. I'm like, okay, so since I already got my eyebrows threaded at the place that I got my Brazilian done, I'm just going to cancel the appointment that I have on Sunday with the girl, right? Here's the thing. I canceled it, but my thing is, I don't understand why these, like, lash tech, hairstylists, like, these people that do services, they will ask for a deposit, and if I cancel my appointment, they'll keep my deposit. Like, why are you keeping my money just because I booked with you? I don't understand. Like, I didn't waste your time. I didn't, you didn't service me. All I did was book an appointment. And I'm really trying to figure out, like, I want to know what the reasoning behind it, all of it is. Like, I'm confused as to why they be taking our deposit. And we don't even be getting the service done. We don't even get, we don't get anything out of you by booking with you. So why are you taking my money? like thinking maybe it's because like we took up a time that somebody could have had but it's like I don't know I don't get it I just really somebody let me know let me know like what the reasoning behind that is because it just doesn't make sense to me at all and I really hate that I seriously need to start paying more attention to what settings I'm recording on because I stay accidentally clicking clicking this little slow-mo setting and it was like annoying because i'll be literally recording my whole talking part of the video or whatever i'm doing and it being slow motion it's like but like when i go to edit it i could put it in the regular speed but there would be no audio 
So that's just really annoying. But <clears throat> we about to be real mindful. Basically, what I was saying was, before I realized I was recording in slow-mo, um, I'm about to make some bagels. Um, and I just took a shot or two of kombucha because it's very important to have your gut health healthy. Okay, and we want to not have a bloated stomach. As time goes on, these stylists and these techs, nail tech, lash tech, whatever, like the policies, the policies are getting stricter, they're getting ruder, they're becoming more unprofessional. And it's just like, people just want to get their nails done. People just want to get their lashes done, their hair done without having to go through all of that extra stuff. Like we're paying you, we're literally paying you if we're not paying you, your bills would not be paid. So why can't you just do my hair without all the extra stuff? Do my lashes, do my brows with all the extra stuff without taking my money? Like, I don't understand. I really don't. But that that is my, that's my rant of the day. That is like my little mini rant of the day. Because I was just thinking about that. Because when I canceled my appointment, it was like your $20 deposit. Um, something about my $20 deposit, I wouldn't be getting it back. I'm like, okay, whatever, it's $20. It's not that big of a deal, but like, dang. I just, I don't understand that. And I've seen that on other people's sites too. It's hap That's not even the first time that's happened to me. That's happened to me with a hairstylist and I canceled and she kept my deposit. Not making sense. <laughs> Chill, I'm honestly gonna lay down for the little time that I can. Because my head is hurting and I'm sleepy. I woke up early. But I'll see y'all back in the car or when I'm leaving to my nail appointment. Bentley, please, like, you're hurting. Okay, I'm back. Back in the car, like I said. Um, I'm on the way to my nail appointment, and I'm running late, actually. But I'm not running that late. I'm not running like that late. I'm only two minutes late. Two minutes late. Honestly, I have no idea what I'm getting on my nails. I have, like, a couple of ideas, but I don't want to, like, just copy, like, a picture. I told her that I wanted, to f I wanted her to freestyle, um, like some colorful nails that I've showed her like I showed her like four pictures and she said that she liked two of them So we're gonna see I just know I want some like colorful like kind of like junk nails um, But yeah, I don't know we gonna see we gonna figure it out. We're gonna chop it up and I need to hurry up. All right, I need to hurry up cuz I'm running late and I don't like playing with people time off because I literally forgot my camera batteries at home so now I'm gonna be able to like not really record for real because I need to save my battery I'm sick but just letting y'all know now like I'm not about to get hella nail content Last time I talked to y'all, I was getting my nails done, and child, I don't know if I said it in the previous clips before, but like, my head was hurting really bad, and I hadn't eaten anything, so after that nail appointment, like, I was feeling crazy, like, I was feeling delirious, I needed to eat something, and I just did not feel well, so I need to stop doing that, <laughs> anyways, my nails, they came out really cute. You know it's on work right now, so don't mind. These are the nails. This is the first hand. And then this is is it focusing? This is the second hand. This is the first hand. 
they're cute they're definitely different because they have like all different designs and i'm not used to like getting a set like this but i know i wanted like colorful nails with like different designs on them because it's my favorite hand though this is my favorite hand because of the star like that star is hard and then she put a little star on my thumb like yeah they just cute and they give so they give summer even though we go on a trip for spring break but but yeah those are my nails um but today i don't have anything to do like maintenance wise because i have work at one and i work pretty much majority of the day um so tomorrow saturday we are let me see what we're doing i have a whole list of everything saturday we have left my hair appointment i have a hair appointment tomorrow at five and then when i do my lashes tomorrow i'm gonna do my own lashes before my appointment that way um i can get the full effect you know and plus she was like you can get ten dollars off your service if you um come with your makeup done so you don't have to tell me twice <laughs> so yeah i'm gonna do my lashes and then i'm getting my hair done tomorrow and then sunday is pretty much like my body care so i'm gonna do it like an everything shower I'm going to be packing and then I'm going to be cleaning. And then Monday, we are on the flight. So, yeah, there's not much left for us to do, but we're getting there. But, yeah, I'm just about to finish this homework and then I have some content to make for TikTok. So, I will see you guys tomorrow. Okay, good morning, guys. It's Saturday and it's like about... 10 15 i want to say actually i have to go back to the no shop because yesterday i was running up the stairs and i hit my toe and it's like cracked a little bit it didn't break but it's cracked so i'm gonna have them fix it and then i want them to like file them down a little bit so that that doesn't happen again because it kind of hurt <laughs> down by my hair you say something you're anti-black and i'm not doing it because i'm literally getting it done today I literally just threw a bun in my head and I'm about to throw Today has been wild. I've been running around all freaking day. Like, it's been a mess. And I'm really surprised I'm making it to my hair appointment on time. So basically what happened was today I woke up, I had to get my toenail fixed because I, like, hit it. And so it, like, kind of cracked. So I went to go to the nail shop early in the morning when they first opened to get that fixed. And then I had to go to the post office because my dad sent me a package, but he put the wrong address on there, or he didn't put the complete address on there. So they didn't deliver it and we, weren't, we didn't know where it was at. So I had to go to the post office to figure out where it was at. I went to like three different post offices and things like that. So that was a mess, but I got my package at the end of the day, so that was good. And then I had to get an oil change. Um, oh my gosh, I'm supposed to be getting off. Anyways, um, I went to go get an oil change and the dude took forever, forever. He's on the phone, he's doing other stuff. Like, I was so pissed off. Cause I'm like, oil changes, I know do not take that freaking long. Mind you, I had to, be back at my house by a certain time because I had to go get my I had to go pick up my package and so I also wanted to do my makeup and do my lashes so I can make content while I get my hair done no I didn't have time to do none of that clearly I have no makeup or lashes on so that kind of just irritated me um but I'm just kind of glad that I'm making it to my appointment on time because I don't really like being late to things and I was just very stressed out but I'm arriving at 4 58 and my appointment is at 5 so I didn't even tell y'all what I'm getting so <laughs> I'm getting a sew-in like a flip over sew-in um hold on I'm 
I'm getting a flip over sew-in with curly bundles. I'm honestly more nervous than I am excited because I've never had a sew-in before. It's a leave out, so I'm gonna be swimming and everything and it's just like, I don't know how it's about to, I don't know, I honestly don't know. So I'm about to park right now and then I'm gonna see y'all when I get in there cause I need to figure out where I'm at cause it's not giving. It ain't giving. It's about to be easy to find this place because I don't know where I'm at, child. So, hold on. nice sorry i'm out of breath <laughs> i'm always out of breath but she was so sweet and i love when like stylists are just nice you know it just makes the experience more i don't know what i'm trying to say but it just makes it better you know but she did my hair really well i'm gonna go home and really like wet it define the curls Cause she obviously like you know doesn't have what I use on my hair but I'm about to head home I will get back to y'all when I get in the crib so we can define these curls but other than that she really did a good job like I love my hair for real, for real. okay so we are back home and I can kind of see how my hair looks OMG my battery is about to die already hold on okay so this is my hair dry, I guess. I mean, yeah, it is dry. Um, but then, like, my leave out, like, she didn't have the products that I use, like, on my actual natural hair. So, it didn't really, like, blend that well. And then it kind of, like, dried fast because my hair is, I don't know if it's low porosity or high porosity, whatever porosity that doesn't, like, get wet easy. That's what I have so got my water bottle right here i mean i got my spray bottle right here also be using this what is this foam from the dough been using that since like high school let's get this started i'm really excited like i'm excited to style my hair because i like my natural curly hair on myself but i've never had long curly hair and I'm excited to just like run the comb through. Like it's gonna eat down. It's gonna eat for sure. Oh yeah, the curl on this is really nice. Really, really cute. I really 
and I have like my wet, my curly hair out like I don't really like a volume like I like definition and it looking like wet so that's what I'm going for right now hopefully my leave out will cooperate um because if not I'm gonna be upset Good morning guys so it is sunday one day until we go on the trip and i'm sorry i really have to stop recording and then just putting my camera down without no nothing like i just i'm sorry y'all just stuff be coming up and yeah but yesterday after i did my hair uh i pretty much like went to sleep because i was tired i was running around all day i'm sorry um, but right now, today, I don't really have any maintenances to do anymore, aside from doing my lashes at home, but, um, I have to go to Target, of course, because we have to get some travel size bottles, and then I need to pick up some other stuff, like dog food. It's 11.42 right now. I'm about to leave to go to Target. I just throw on some clothes, to be honest. Um, so, yeah. Meet y'all in the car. Boy, do I have some tea for y'all. OMG, it looks like I have no hair, but my bun is sitting low, y'all. I promise my hair is just in a bun. I need to fix it, honestly, because, girl, you're going into Target. <laughs> but at the same time, I don't care. Like, who am I to impress? You know? And I'm about to be looking like a baddie on the island. While y'all are stuck in Atlanta. Anyways. Um. <laughs> my freaking cousin just called me. I had a missed call from my cousin and my friend. Those are the two people that I'm going on the trip with. Um. I called my cousin back first. And she told me that. The hairstylist is not doing my friend's hair. The one. The other one that I had a missed call from. But I had to. I have to call her back because I'm in the parking garage and she wasn't going to be able to hear me because I had no service. Here, not done. The bitch only got some knowledge in the back of her head. So, okay. I'm like, okay, but I'm irritated that she just told me no. So, I'm calling Brie's phone and she's seen it, right? So, oh. um, come about, this bitch just texted me and said she, she went home. She said, I can go home. She don't feel comfortable doing my hair. Uh All right, she just finished telling me the story, but I'm here at Target. And I hope there's not a lot of people in here. But honestly, it, I don't know. I can't really tell. I mean, the, the parking lot is kind of full, but we're going to see. So I'm in the sandal aisle right now. Trying on some sandals because I don't have no black sandals. Hold on, let me move my car. I know some sandals right now. I don't know which ones I want, though. It's between those three. I've been trying them on, but I just need, like... A neutral color sandal. These are really cute too, but I don't have nothing to wear with them. I don't know, y'all. I think I'm gonna just get. I really like the brown ones too, but I feel like they're not gonna go with everything. And then black is cute too. I think I should just get black. I don't know, y'all. Get both? <laughs> I already have like some. I think I'm gonna get black because I have some glittery ones and then I'm bringing some brown ones. So, the black is so plain. I don't know, y'all. <laughs> so, I'm decided. I'm gonna just go ahead and get the white ones because I feel like they give a little pop, you know. And black, I don't know, it was just getting some dull. I don't know. What's really, really, really messing with the dullness of the, of the black. I wasn't giving vacation but i don't really see any other sandals i like i never really looked around for a bro but I 
Are these cute? Uh -oh. I see these. I don't know. Are these cute? I don't know how I feel about them. They're very different, but I'm about to try them on. Those were cute, but they don't have my size, so it's just not meant to be. <laughs> All right, so I'm in the travel section aisle and I found some travel size things. I think I'm gonna get like this for my body wash, and then I think I'm gonna get a spray bottle for my hair, but I'm not sure because this like little nozzle thing is not like spray straight, and I need it to be like if that makes sense. So I'm gonna get this. I think I'm gonna get another one. I wish they had pink. I'm gonna get those two. And then I need a mouthwash, so I'm gonna get a mouthwash too. I think I'm gonna just get this one. Yeah, I think that should work. Um, I need some sunscreen, and then I put Dio soap on my on my list, but I don't know if I'm gonna get that because it comes in a pack of three, and I only need one. Actually, I could get the pack of three because I'd be using it, and I don't have any more, so I'm gonna just get the pack of three. Right here. I need some wipes too. I think I should get some wipes. I'm gonna be feeling sticky and stuff, and like you know, wipes are just gonna have. So I think I'm gonna just get these baby wipes. So I'm looking for this specific like sunscreen that be making like I guess people skin glow. I have it in my phone, but I don't see it here. I need to keep looking. Alright, so I found the sunscreen I was talking about. It's this one from Neutrogena. I guess they say it makes your skin glow, and I see it on TikTok, so. I think that's all for this Target trip. I need to find some dog food, and I don't see it, so I'm about to go look for some dog food, and then we're heading out of here, because we're not buying no unnecessary stuff. We're standing on business today. Okay. Okay, y'all, so I'm back home from Target and all right, Target haul. All right, so first I got the little sandals I was looking at. I ended up going with white ones because I feel like they're gonna go with everything. And the black ones, I don't know, they were just was giving real dull. It just wasn't the vibe, so I ended up getting the white ones. And they're gonna be cute. Just to throw on, you know. I just had picked up this razor that I seen in the travel section because I don't know if I have any more. And I need to shave my legs tonight. I need to do the full shower routine tonight. So that's what we're gonna do later. I got this B Girl from the dough because y'all saw yesterday that I used the dough like foam i'm running out of that and i need a product that's gonna hold my hair like my leave out um and make it curly so i saw this like it's a strong 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 hold and i need a strong hold so i'm gonna bring this i'm gonna see how it works i don't know i think i'm gonna just try when i get out there because i don't think i'm gonna do anything to my hair before i go to the airport i don't know we'll see then i got the sunscreen that i was <laughs> the sunscreen that i was talking about that I guess make sure your skin glow or whatever and we need sunscreen period because it's gonna be super super hot and I got some wipes because you can never go wrong with some wipes gotta stay fresh get you a little wipe boom boom you're good got some dial soap because dial soap top tier if you wash your if you wash your body with dial soap I just know you're clean I know you're squeaky clean got these travel size bottles because i want to put body wash in them and then probably something else that i want to take um because i want to smell like tropical so i want to put my mango dove body wash in here so that i can just smell real good got this travel size mouthwash because you know breath can be stinking then i got this mini micellar water because i'm running out of my small one and that's pretty much all we got from target we were standing on business a little bit. We pretty much did stand on business with going in there and buying what we really needed. Oh, and I also got some dog food, but it's in the kitchen. But yeah, 
that's everything we got from Target. I'm gonna do my lashes right now before it gets dark because I want to do them with like the natural light. I'm doing my clusters, of course, um, but I really need them to eat down because we're going on vacation, you know. And I have like all different types of clusters but like they're all different they're like all different like lengths curls so i know i want to go for like a natural look you know i don't want like dramatic lashes because i feel like i have dramatic hair like i have long curly big hair not big but you know so i want to go for natural lashes ones from the eyes that they sent me i think i'm gonna do those i was thinking about doing bottom lashes too but i feel like that really wouldn't fit the aesthetic we're going for. Lashes are done. They look so freaking good definitely what i was going for and i don't think these are gonna come off i put the sealant the glue i was squeezing them so they could like really like beat on my lash for real and this look this glue like it's good with water like it doesn't really the lashes don't come off like if water gets on them so i should be good as long as i'm not like really like swimming for real for real like I'll be straight. These are gonna last, but I'm still gonna bring like my lash clusters and my glue and stuff like that just in case for some touch ups. But these look bomb. These look bomb for sure. I also forgot to show you guys my nails because I went to I have went to go get um one of my nails fixed because it chipped. Y'all, I'm so rough. Like I'm so rough. Stubbed my toe. That freaking cracked then i freaking <laughs> broke a nail like girl i have basically got my nail fixed and then i asked her to like change the design and then i got a different color i'll just show you but these are my nails and then that was the one that chipped and so we did the dots instead of what i had before yeah and then this is my other one and I changed the color of this, how I had it before. So yeah. I'm back, it's like way, way later in the day and it's time to pack my bags. Um, I have everything in that luggage right there that I need to take with me. I just need to look on my iPad to see like what I need to pack for real, for real. Put all my outfits together on my iPad with this little app and stuff like that. So I'm gonna charge my iPad and I'm gonna put, I'm gonna lay out all my outfits. Um, and then we're gonna start packing because we leave tomorrow and I shouldn't have waited the last minute. But yeah, so this is what I was talking about that I did for the trip. I like planned out all my outfits and stuff like that so that it was like easy to figure out what I was gonna wear and stuff like that and just have it all organized. But I put, I put everything on the bed. Um, so I'm just about to put everything in here. The only thing I don't have on the bed is like underwear, stuff like that. And then after I put everything in there, I'm gonna get like my jewelry and stuff together and then my toiletries last. I might do my toiletries tomorrow, honestly. So I think I'm gonna just pack my clothes today and then do my toiletries tomorrow because I still have to like use stuff. Okay, so I am pretty much probably 80% done packing. I have all my fits and then I put some of my toiletries that I'm not using in, a, in their bags, like my makeup, stuff like that. All my shoes are on the side. I just pretty much, 
need to pack like underwear and stuff like that but I'm washing clothes as you could probably hear but I'm washing clothes right now so I'm probably gonna do that tomorrow um, but as far as packing that's pretty much almost done but now it's time to take a shower do our everything shower we need to shave um, and then I want to do a little skincare because my skin is not the best right now but it could be better and I want it to be like to be glowing it needs to give melanin <laughs> so, okay so my camera actually died um but i just did my skincare like i said after i was shaving my face um i put some acne spot treatment on my face and then this pimple patch like i said and skin's glowing skin is definitely glowing but this does conclude the end of today's video i really hope you guys enjoyed the video i loved it um make sure you guys are subscribed to my channel if you're not and tune in to the actual girls trip vlog because we're gonna have a time okay but make sure you like comment and subscribe and i will see you guys in my next video bye